attacker on the internet will easily guess your password if you use a simple password. And in the latter well, we have a package to prevent a user using a ritual password like a QWERTY, which is mostly user press their keyboard on a single line of row. And today I'm going to show you how to validate user input with password in the Laravel by using a package named Laravel password, which is easily set up and can prevent the user from input simple password. I suppose you have installed Laravel and this is the project. So I'm going to install the package, open up the terminal and going to install with the command. Unicode developer slash Laravel dash password and actually I'm going to apply this in the Laravel 9 now I will migrate the table in the database because I'm will using the authentication with the registration password and before I'm run migration I will add a line of code for limited string, so I'm going to update in the app service provider with the schema string. And import using a schema on the top. So by the way, don't forget checking the database connection in the .ere file before running the migration which is we have a database name, username and password. And I have created a database name Laravel which is the default in the .ere file. Okay now we refresh that and we have no any table in here. So now I'm going to uh, run the command migration and it's gonna successfully generate the table in here. And we start install the authentication scaffold UI and then we are going to install the bootstrap UI. Now I will update the package.json to use the Laravel Max because by default Laravel 9 is come with Vite by default and I'm going to build with the Max so I'm going to update this for the compiling and save the file and we can run the npm to install the Laravel Max After that, we run a command npm install and last we run npm run delve to install and then we run once again to compile the dependency and now it's build success. So I'm going to open up the register controller file to update some code and I will add an, an element array dump pwd which is uh, for validating the password and then I will customize the message password which will locate it in this directory if you use another Laravel version it might be different and in this case, I'm using Laravel 9 and I will modify in this validation file, add the associate array. The key is which is matched to the validation key 
in the register controller which we have uh, at, at the moment and for the message I'm going to say uh, that your password is too common and now I'm going to start run the Laravel server and open the URL so I'm going to try that for example just fill in the randomly and for the password I'm going to inspect the elements in the browser to change to the password type in the HTML element so that you can see the password what I'm actually put in And this validation is another validation limit password. Limit password length, it means uh, we limit the, the length of the password that you have to input more than eight. I will try to extend more than eight characters. So I'm going to input a couple times. and then we're going to click the register button and here we can see that the validation error so i will try another common password such as a, like a number one to eight or something like that and it's still validation fine and the package you can find in this link or you can read this for more detail and how to use the custom the message and i also leave the link in the description anyway if you want to read the article i have written that for the article related to the laravel or another short tutorial please visit campbelltutorial.com which i am usually post and i hope this tutorial help you to implement validating strong password in the laravel app please consider subscribe and like my video if you think this helpful and i will see you in the next video thanks